Hello from Slovenia. I have some things to say today before I start. So, Arteza sent me this um, package of 14 uh, beautiful colors. They came in this uh, pockets. Uh, really nice to use. You can really squeeze everything out. Um, and uh, these uh, 60 colors um, little tubes uh, so you can see what uh, paints are looking for they are well described here about um, transparency and all of this so I love it so far I played a little bit and yes also they sent me some canvases but today I will not use um, uh, this canvas because I will do something else <coughs> about Arteza uh, I am a part uh, of his uh, of their affiliate program, so I will put a um, link to their um, their uh, store to my uh, in my description. Then, if you order through this link, I get a little from this too. Uh, no extra cost for you, just a benefit for me that I will be able to do videos for you. So if you want to support me this way and if you are buying Curtiza paints, you can use <coughs> my link too. So they are when I mix them, they mix really well. They are creamy. They are so vibrant. I play a little with my consistency still because they are different uh, thickness that, that than my uh, previous paints that I use. So I hope that this will work okay. And I will try to do some reverse deep, flower deep with paper towel to see how this um, Arteza paints work in this kind of uh, pouring, with this pouring technique. So. <clears throat> Sorry. <clears throat> I will do sides later if so that I won't be too long. I did uh, one pour yesterday <coughs> with these paints and I like them, but I think that I'm not quite there yet because they really react a little different than my previous ones. So <clears throat> I have to practice. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, <coughs> I just have something in my throat. So, I mixed this uh, phthalo green with just a little bit of blue to get more Taylo turquoise color kind of 
I will just do little stripes. And this is olive green. You know I like to use my green gold and this color is similar, not the same but similar. So I hope that I will get some of these um, results that I want. So I don't have uh, paint in my squeeze bottles. So I will just do this with my sticks. This is phthalo blue. I can show you the consistency. I hope you see. You see they are so vibrant and so creamy and I like them so far but I will see how this will work with my flower dips I will do just two flower two flowers this one is a little weird but I don't know, maybe three puddles. And this is um, pearl sapphire blue. See, it runs off the stick really nice. I hope I will get. Uh, these effects like with my metallic white with this you will see For the middle, I will use gold. I have left uh, a little bit from my yesterday's yesterday from yesterday when I told you that that I was playing with this a little bit, but I didn't do flower dip so. We will see. And this is uh, ultramarine blue. Maybe I will drop a little white. Whoops. My white is a little thinner because I use it for a background so I hope this this will not be a problem and I have a violet for I want 
to add it here to maybe darken up this center. We will see how this will go work or not or what we will get. Just try to tap this um, our petals a little bit and not too much. colors but I didn't get the shape that I want I forget yes I had silicone in one paint yesterday that I use I think that phthalo so you see but now it is what it is I see bubbles here I have to of them. I don't want to torch too much because I really don't want to get too much cells but now it is what it is. Uh 
have a go almost got to the canvas here. this big didn't like this big blob of green this is okay I have air bubbles here it's kind of oops Kind of interesting, I think. I just have to add white here on the corners because I pull off my paint. It's missing here. This uh, paint will level out when it dries, so if you don't know, just to know that this will not stay like this, this levels out completely when drying, while drying, or what is the right word for this? while drying or yes i think that this is the right word while do between drying process <laughs> between the drying process or a little bit here I like the colors because they are really beautiful. I don't know what you think, but I think that they are beautiful. this uh, little flower petal here or flower bud here to kind of like these cells like uh, they're <laughs> like uh, uh, raindrops on it I just don't like this part here because just Separate these things 
here. So maybe using a little silicone uh, isn't so bad idea, but I forgot that I have it in my Taylor. Just want to open this a little bit. I'm not sure if I like this or not, but uh, I think that I should do this because it was just a blob and I don't like it. And this one here bothers me a little bit. I will cover you up and take you for a close-up. I think that it's pretty. You see this uh, cells looks uh, almost like rain you see this one and this um, violet gives some depth to like some underwater flower or something so I'm pretty happy with the result colors are gorgeous and I'm looking forward to try another painting with this Arteza paints please check my uh, description when I will put all of this that I say and you can support me this way too so this was it for our first review what can I say I'm more than happy I'm in love so see you on the next one bye